Hello and welcome to Rosie's Kitchen today. Today I need to take a meal over to uh, a friend and uh, she had surgery on her knee and she's got four kids and she doesn't want to put pressure on her husband. But anyway, I told her I'd bring food over to her. So I'm going to make lemon herb chicken and this is how you do it. And this is what you need for the lemon chicken. I've got the, you need four to six pieces of chicken breast, boneless, depending on their size. Four large or four, six medium. And two, one tablespoon of salt, one tablespoon of Mrs. Dashes, uh, one teaspoon, I mean three fourths a teaspoon of garlic powder or three garlic, clo garlic cloves, uh, one teaspoon of ground oregano, one tablespoon of thyme leaves, one teaspoon of paprika, and a half a teaspoon of crushed red peppers. And then a half a cup of lemon juice squeezed, and a, I mean a, f a fourth a cup of lemon juice and a fourth a cup of olive oil. Now we'll just pour all of this in. And we're going to put it in the fridge for a couple hours to marinate. And then we're going to fry it up. I'm taking dinner to Amanda's friend. She's having surgery on her knee today. So she doesn't want to have to have her husband have to cook. <laughs> so stir all this in. Just kind of get it soaked in there. You know, just kind of let it set on the chicken there. And let it set in the fridge. And I put it in a plastic bag because it didn't seem like it was getting very well coated. So just make sure it's coated really well. This is coating much better than trying to stir it in the pan. Then it can sit in this bag for a couple of hours. We'll be back to cook you up. It has been a couple of hours. It's been marinating. So let's heat the pan up. I put a little bit of oil in there. And then let's pour, we'll pour the chicken on there and cook it about 20 minutes. Pour that on there. And these are fat. These are fat, <laughs> the Yeti. These are fat um, pieces of chicken. So I'm going to cut them. Usually you pound them flat, but I did not. And so I'm just going to cut them lengthwise when they thaw out because they were frozen. Okay. Let's get these cooking. So I cut the, each of the chickens in half lengthwise. Now we're just going to let them sit here and cook. Mm -mm -mm. And turn the chicken over and let it absorb all that marinara, marinade that we put in there. That took another five minutes. Okay, the chicken is done. And when I take food to people, I like to use something that they don't have to worry about giving back to me. So we'll just put the chicken in here and I put some potatoes, some baked potatoes. And there's your lemon herb chicken. It's a little on the hot side. The kids might not like it, I don't know. Hot like spicy. Hot. Okay. Let's put the potatoes in there. I've got everything ready to take over to my friend. Some leftover sketty, that's all ready. <laughs> some leftover rolls from yesterday. Take over some jam and do the, um, the lem lemon herb chicken and some baked potatoes. So hopefully the kids will like that. I know they'll like the sketty. 
and it's real easy to bake them in the instant pot for 20 minutes. That's a quick easy meal and I baked uh, some potatoes in the instant instant pot that only took 20 minutes and so that's easy chicken and remember I do my DIYs every Friday at 2. Thanks and see y'all next week and bye.